In today's video on Mighty Military, we take a closer look at a major milestone in Turkey's growing naval defense capabilities. Roketsan has officially confirmed that its Levent close-in air defense missile has completed its first seeker-guided interception against a live airborne target during a test on 20 November. This achievement marks a major step forward in Turkey's push to build a fully sovereign, modern naval protection layer capable of countering today's drone-heavy and cruise missile threats. The test took place on 20 November 2025 and was announced by Roketsan through an official update on X. With this single event, Turkey approved that Levent can autonomously detect, track, and destroy a genuine airborne threat moving the system from concept toward real operational capability at sea. In an era where massed drone attacks, sea-skimming missiles, and low-observable aerial threats are becoming the norm, having an indigenous close-in protection system is strategically important for the Turkish Navy and for export customers looking for alternatives to U.S. and European systems. Levent is designed by Roketsan as a shipborne close-in missile system using a trainable launcher that carries 11 missiles and integrates radar and electro-optical sensors. This allows 360-degree autonomous surveillance, tracking, and engagement. Each missile is 3.2 meters long, 128 millimeters in diameter, weighs around 75 kilograms, and has an effective range of up to 11 kilometers. It carries a 10-kilogram fragmentation warhead with a proximity fuse optimized to break apart fast-moving incoming missiles, small unmanned systems, and loitering munitions. The hybrid seeker, combining imaging infrared with a passive RF channel, is built to maintain lock even in cluttered coastal environments or under electronic warfare conditions. With high agility and rapid reaction time, the missile is tailored for intercepting sea-skimming anti-ship missiles, fast aircraft, helicopters, UAVs, and cruise missile-like threats in their terminal phase. The development path of Levent highlights Turkey's shift toward domestically built close-in defense systems. First showcased at IDEF 2023 in Istanbul and later displayed at international exhibitions like Dimdex 2024, the system uses a navalized version of Roketsan's short-range air defense missile adapted for ship launch and guidance. A successful land-based firing in October 2024 confirmed basic missile performance. By March 2025, sea trials began aboard the Turkish Navy Corvette TCG Bakos in the Black Sea. These trials verified the integration of the launcher, sensors, and the ship's combat management system. Now, with the successful seeker-guided live interception in November 2025, Roketsan has validated the entire engagement chain from detection to tracking to target destruction under realistic conditions. From a capability standpoint, Levent gives Turkey a modern, independent option in a field long dominated by foreign systems like the RIM-116 rolling airframe missile and MBDA's Sea Scepter. RAM offers a similar short-range envelope with a dual-mode seeker, but remains a U.S.-German system with strict export controls. Sea Scepter extends beyond 25 kilometers and functions more as an area defense weapon. Levent sits in a unique middle ground. Its 11-kilometer range and hybrid seeker give it reaction speed for inner-layer protection, while its missile architecture, derived from a national MANPADS and SHORAD family, reduces logistical and training complexity. Compared to older gun-based CIWS systems, Levent's missile-centric design dramatically expands the defended area and increases hit probability for small, agile, or low-observable threats. Strategically, this successful guided intercept strengthens Turkey's long-term goal of creating a fully independent naval air defense network, ranging from long-range systems like Seeper to close-in systems such as Goksor, Gokdeniz, and now Levent. For the Turkish Navy, this reduces vulnerability to sanctions or supply restrictions at a time when operations in the Black Sea, Eastern Mediterranean, and Red Sea are becoming more demanding and unpredictable. With Levent integration possible on corvettes, frigates, and even larger patrol vessels, Turkey gains a stronger defensive shield against drone swarms and saturation missile attacks. The system also has strong export potential, especially for navies looking for modern, affordable alternatives to RAM or older gun systems. 
The first seeker-guided hit by Levent is more than just a successful test. It signals that Turkey a is close to fielding a fully indigenous close-in missile shield for its surface fleet, one specifically designed for the drone-heavy, missile-dense naval environment emerging in the region. As Turkey a strengthens its technological autonomy and expands its defense export portfolio, systems like Levent will play a critical role in reshaping naval security in contested waters. This is Mighty Military and we will keep bringing you detailed updates on the world's most advanced and rapidly evolving military systems. Stay tuned for more.